There's a procedure I want to go over for increasing supination and pronation of the elbow. It's actually quite simple, but it works really well, and I think it works a little bit better than just focusing on one or the other. Now, this is a great one for people that are suffering from either golfers or tennis elbow. So I'm going to take about to shake your hand here. Now, it's really important when you do this procedure not to straighten out the arm, because if we do that, we'll be working more on the shoulder than we actually go over the elbow. So Mickey, what I want you to do is I want you to actually just take your hand over here. You feel that? That's Right nice. a bit. Now I'm going to go on the inside of the arm, take it over, take it into as far as you can into supination. Back into pronation. Take it over. How are we doing? That's good. I like that. Back. It's a very simple procedure, but it works really well. Back and over again and have the person take their hand as much as they can into pronation and supination. Back here into supination. You okay? Yeah. Now, this is so important because if we look at, this is the common extensor tendon on the side here, common flexor tendon. So all with the common flexor tendon, all the muscles here basically connect there and, and run down the arm here. The one on the outside here, the common extensor tendon, everything comes down from here. So if we can open up these two areas here, this is gonna make a big difference in terms of mobility of the elbow. This is great for golfers.